actress, <laughs> producer, and director Lucy Liu has appeared in more than 80 films. It's like a Warner Brothers cartoon. <laughs> uh, but one of her most memorable roles was the vicious Ling Wu on the hit drama Ali McBeal. She was then cast as well, Charlie's Angels, and the film franchise went head to head with Uma Thurman in Kill Bill. But for the past three years, Lucy has been solving crimes as Sherlock Holmes' partner, Dr. Joan Watson, on the TV series Elementary. And when Sherlock tells her the pair is no longer allowed to consult for the NYPD, Dr. Watson sticks by Sherlock's side. Check it out. When it comes to what we do, the only thing that matters to me is our partnership. So you go, I go. You offered me a job. I didn't take it to work with the police. I took it to work with you. Well, you should know that my detractors are not limited to the NYPD. My professional prospects are quite bleak in general. We'll figure it out. We always do. There it is. Ooh. Lucy Lou, good morning. <laughs> good good to morning. See you. Now we settled the chaos is over. It's so good to have you here with us. So people know the fundamental story behind the relationship, but this is a totally new spin on it over the last four seasons. How are, are Watson, Sherlock and Watson getting along these days? Um, I think that their relationship finally has come to a very even um, sort of foundation where she's not his sober companion, so she's not I'm constantly so trying to help him, mm -hmm. and he's not trying to sort of um, poke at her in that way and sort of um, get her to say something that's negative. And now, not, they're not just partners now, but they're really friends. It so it was her suggestion at the end of season three to move back in, which I think really has been mm -hmm. helpful. Um, I don't know, it's, it's going to be wonderful because this year we're also introducing his father, who we talk about a lot, but we haven't actually seen before. And I think seeing a family dynamic always adds an element of surprise and, and I think in some ways comedy, because seeing people with their, you know, interact with their families yeah. is always very funny. Not for that person necessarily, but for the, for yes. the audience. <laughs> the fourth season though, I mean, this is resonating so well with viewers. Why do you think that is? Um, I think that honestly, Arthur Conan Doyle uh, wrote something and wrote characters that were so rich and colorful that there's always something to draw on. And I think that's why there's so so many incarnations of Sherlock Holmes. And I think people are engaged with that. It, you know, people that are fans and also people that are curious about what did they do. And I think modernizing that idea yeah. is always going to work. And, and you've also directed a few episodes. Do you, does that exercise different muscles for you in doing something like that? Absolutely. I mean, it's such an amazing thing to engage with the people that you work with on a daily basis, but behind the scenes, because you really get to become more intimate with them. And then it's a different sort of creativity, too, because it's not just this microcosm of I'm just going to show up and I'm going to act and I'm going to do my lines and I'm going to interview with people, let's say. You're actually going to do everything behind the scenes and you get to see how much work you know, goes into even, you know, clearing a name or putting, you know, something on a, on a paper, you know. Yeah. Um, it's really involved, and I think it really gives you a better idea of how things are done, how things are produced and created from a, from a seed. And can we just say congratulations, because we understand you're a new mom, too. Yes, you I'm a new You have a little mom. son, I Rockwell. Do. Yes, he is 68 oh, oh, days old. 68 days. You're, <laughs> yes. you're down to the days and the hours, yes. right? Yes, and I know that because um, every day is just, is just a miracle and a dream because... It, it, everything is so different every yeah. day, you know? So you're not even thinking about, is it Monday or Tuesday or what mm -hmm. time it is anymore? You're just thinking about how how he's changed from, yeah. you know, minute to minute and his reactions and um, and also just how you are and yeah. how you grow as a, as a human being, being around another human being, you know, like that. He's I love the name too, Rockwell. Rock well. Is it Rocky for short? <laughs> I hope not, but... <laughs> Not. <laughs> that's right here right now. Put that out there. Rockwell. At what point will you tell Rockwell that his mother was name checked in an Outcast song? <laughs> I don't know. It might be really a long okay. time. Okay. It'll be ancient by then. Lucy, it's so fun talking to you. Oh, Congratulations. The new season of Elementary premieres this Thursday on CBS. Hello, today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.